Melanogaster, better known as the common fruit fly. But I like to call this little guy Buzz. He, you named them? You know they only live like 10 days, right? Yeah, but while they're around, Buzz and his friends are going to help me demonstrate evolution and crush my science fair competition. That's right, you, yes, you, 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 you are cushy cushy. <laughs> okay, what's the big deal anyway? Big deal? That baby is gonna be mine for like the fifth year in a row. I rock. That's what I like about you, Ty. You're so modest. <laughs> Cleanbot's a work in progress. I haven't quite fine-tuned him for the science fair yet. Science fair? That's, That's amazing! amazing. Cleanbot rules! Uh, can I get my bag back? Who is that? And why'd his robot try and eat me? He's some new transfer student. From where? <laughs> the future? Easy, What's the matter, Ty? <laughs> Seeing your chances of winning getting sucked away? <laughs> expose Buzz and friends to selective pressure, like extreme cold. The survivors, who lived because they were naturally resistant to the cold, have babies. Some of those kids like the cold even more, so they survive and have kids of their own. And the flies gradually adapt more and more to the cold weather. I get it. Eventually, you've got fruit flies that could party up at the North Pole. That's pretty cool, Ty. Was pretty cool. Mm. That trophy was so mine. Yeah, bugs just can't compete with robots. Everyone knows that. Now that's what I call a little fine tuning. <laughs> Thanks for rubbing it in. Real mature. Oh, and I suppose that is. Hmm? <laughs> uh. <laughs> Relax. I know you'll win. You're Ty Archer, and science is your thing, right? <clears throat> of course. That also makes it way more humiliating if Pat wins the trophy. Oh. <laughs> <sighs> no pressure. Good night. Oh. No kid with a souped-up vacuum cleaner is going to break my five-year winning streak. I think I need a little help. Not even a squeak, okay? What do I need? Egg 
fish? Nah. Sloppy Joe stink, though. Hmm. Nah. Fart power robot? No. Aha! Uh -huh. Insectifus class 5 insect mutagen. Perfect. Sorry, Buzz, but I can't wait months for your great-great-grandkids to show adaptations. I need some evolutionary magic now! Huh? Oh man, I can't do this. Pat's robot is just plain better. If I win, it's not gonna be by cheating. I never cheated before and... <gasps> Who's there? Hmm. Phew. Too close. <laughs> wow, your project kinda exploded. Who could have done this? Although, it looks like it's shattered from the inside out. If you ask me, there's a lot of shifty-looking people in this room. And I haven't done a good interrogation in months. Picking up traces of... mutagen? What? Uh, did I say mutagen? Uh, there's no mutagen here. Uh, nope, nope, nope. This is a mutagen-free zone. <laughs> Salutations, Ty. Pat. I heard about your project going, uh, you know... Kaboom. You seem to know a lot about it. What? No, no, no. <laughs> Trust me, if I want something to explode, it really explodes. All it takes is a little, uh, fine-tuning. I see. We suspect sabotage. Wow. Sabotage is fascinating, uh, psychologically speaking. This would make a great subject for a scientific paper, don't you agree? Nope. Wow, Ty, he's more you than you. Hey, a viscous green substance. That has to be a clue. Uh, I'm sure it was just a stray, um, uh, a meteorite. Uh, a green, gooey meteorite. Mm hmm <laughs> Saved by the screen. Uh, gotta go, Pat. Uh, see you around. <laughs> No, they couldn't be. Come on, Ty. Swat now. Analyze <laughs> later. Professionals. <laughs> get it off, get it off, get it off me! <laughs> oh, yeah, very professional. <laughs> Look out! Ha! Now you can be cocky. That should hold them. I wonder where they came from. Better call in the cleanup squad. Gaster. Oh, man. They are my flies. I must have gotten mutagen on them. Mutagen? It's gotta be Insectiva. Yeah, this crime has obsessed Bug Lover written all over it. The last time I checked, she was still locked up. Look, it's uh, not a problem anymore, right? We got rid of all the bugs, so case closed. 
giant bugs attack the school and you don't want to know why? Yeah, we gotta figure out how these flies got supersized. Already done. Nothing unusual, they're just totally normal giant gross mutant bugs. I'm gonna, uh, return these guys to the specimen room now. Bye. Do you think Ty's been acting a little strange lately? Hey, I work in a secret lab analyzing boogers all day and my best friend's a rat. What exactly do you mean by strange? Well, the bugs were a bust. Time for science project plan B. Phew. Someone looks like they're having a bad science day. You know what cheers me up? Quadratic equations. <laughs> you know what would cheer me up? You stopping. Look, CleanBot's all fine-tuned for the science fair, so I've got some time. I thought we could work together. Two genius IQs are better than one. Look, no offense, but aren't we supposed to be competing or something? <laughs> wow, there sure is a lot of screaming at this school. Talk about bad taste. They're eating cafeteria food. Better them than us. I almost feel bad for the little guys. Whoa, they've got upgrades. Idea, Abby. Instant flypaper. Mm -mm. Weird. I thought we got him all the first time. Guess we missed a few. Okay, here's the lowdown. The nets didn't work in the cafeteria because these bugs have super strong mandibles. No kidding. Two questions. Where did they come from, and how did they get so strong? No idea, and no idea. But remember that bunch of bugs you grabbed from the hallway yesterday? Well, they've been busy. Meet their great-great-great-grandchildren. Wow. How fast are they breeding? They're laying around 500 eggs every few hours. If we don't find the source of these bugs fast, we're gonna be drowning in them. Oh, oh man. I caused this, so I'm gonna fix it. Gotta find out where those flies are. Bingo! Just follow the mutagen trail. These guys sure do get around. Wow, you'd be kind of cute if it wasn't for the slime and the whole glow-in-the-dark eyes thing. <laughs> oh, man! Can we, uh, talk about this? Crack. 
Baker. Ah. Oh, oh yeah. You guys prefer fruit, right? Right, fruit. Hey. <laughs> Making friends, I see. Bug bombs. Yes. Come on. Trying to fix my mistake. Uh, mistake? You had something to do with those flies? I used some of Insectiva's mutagen to kick out my science project a little. By accident, I... <laughs> accident? I can't believe you, Ty! It's Pat's fault! If he hadn't invented that dumb robot, I wouldn't have had to use the mutagen. Mm, nice try! <laughs> what have you got against Pat anyway? You two seem so much alike, except for the whole cheating at the science fair thing. Hey, if we get eaten by giant fruit flies, I'm sorry. Figure it, we've only got one chance. We gotta neutralize all of them at once. Yeah, then they won't have a chance to adapt. <gasps> and I know just the person to help us clean up this problem. Are you sure there's no other way to do this? Yep. Besides, it's fun to watch you squirm. Oh, come on, Abby. Anyone but him. Hey. This doesn't look like a surprise physics conference. We called you here. We're professional grossologists. Wow! <laughs> We've got a problem and we... Oh, I can't do this. We made a mistake calling you here, so see ya, okay? Ugh. Fine. Okay, look. We've got giant mutant bugs to stop and we could really use your help. Wow! I'm in! <laughs> Great. Hey, do I get a cool uniform, too? Definitely not. <laughs> Ew! How can you guys stand that smell? This? Oh, this is nothing compared to the time Sloppy Joe made the world's biggest stink bomb. Now that was smelly. I'm sorry, Pat. Is the smell bothering you? That's really too bad. Have you considered moving to a new city or a mm, uh, country? <laughs> <laughs> Golly, we've got insects approaching at high velocity. Take cover! Fruit flies can't resist a juicy pile of rotten fruit. Did it just... Yep, fruit flies vomit their digestive juices onto their food before they eat it. Cool, huh? Cool. <laughs> yeah, really cool. Okay, Pat, you're on! Prepare to be sterilized. Pests detected. Nice! Uh-oh! Looks like it still needs some uh, fine-tuning! <laughs> Not this time, bug brains. Yes, the manual controls. Wow, Mom 
Mom and Dad would love one of those. Okay, okay, I admit it. This thing is pretty cool. Whoa! Ah! Uh, avert your eyes. Uh, <laughs> that, that was my fault. Pat, we'd like to thank you on behalf of the Bureau of Grossology. Wouldn't we? Mm, I guess. We couldn't have done it without CleanBot. <clears throat> or you. Thanks! Wow, you've got some pretty cool technology. Thanks. Although, with a little fine-tuning, I bet I could double the output. <laughs> uh, uh, thanks, but I don't think the Bureau is ready for your fine-tuning. The winner of the Ringworm Science Competition is... <coughs> uh, Pat and Cleanbot. Yay, round of applause. So, how does it feel to finally lose a science competition? Hey, Pat deserved to win. I'm happy for him. Really? Sure, but he'd better watch out next year. Maybe he builds cool robots, but uh, has Pat ever been to uh, the moon? Oh, brother. Oh, oh, oh. It just needs some fine-tuning! <laughs> <laughs>